My name's Rod. Five years ago, we got this boat, cheap, cheap fiberglass boat, decided to convert it to electric. Electric is what I do. Like I've been doing electric things for 15 years now, uh, converting cars to electric. And I started off back in the 1990s with bicycles, and then graduated to cars, and then started working on lithium batteries and electric motors. We built our own marine drive, inboard marine drive, uh, shaft drive motor for this boat and um, we've installed it on the boat. Have a look at the, what we've done here. So we have batteries. That's a lithium battery pack. That's actually a, a second life battery pack that was came out of, a, out of my old electric car. We have electric motor here, carefully crafted control box so that we can um, control the speed and direction of the motor. Down the back here we have um, our propeller. So it's a shaft drive system. This, this propeller came from the bottom of the harbour in Queensland. I got it off Gumtree. <laughs> somebody, somebody had salvaged it off a sunken boat. And steering, Jamie's just done it. This is all highly theoretical at the moment, but we, we're hoping it's gonna work. Now this, this propeller, I've done a bit of research on the internet and it's what's called, supposed to be what's called a surface drive. Now, people who are boat people will have a laugh because the propeller's not a surface drive propeller, but that's what we're doing. So we're, we're hoping that, that, that only as, as we get the speed up, that, that less and less of the propeller will be in the water until only the bottom half of the blades is in the water, and that's what's called a surface drive. So it gives you your best kind of thrust. Um, and we don't know if it's going to work or not. You know, it might work, it might not. It might just throw up a huge rooster tail, uh, who knows. Um, it's, all, it's all dead reckoning, isn't it? We, we sort of tried to get the, the level of the, the, the water coming out the bottom of the yeah. boat, the same height as the propeller, well, yeah. it's going to be. But. Yeah, so it, it'll come out, the water will rise a bit, and the faster you go, the less the water rises. So the propeller will be virtually fully submerged when we're, when we're stationary, and then as, we, as you build up speed, there's less and less of the propeller actually touching the water. That's the theory. Um, the practice will probably be quite different. This is our first. And today we find out if our, all of our kind of assumptions and hypotheses are correct or, or if they're seriously flawed. Are we going to Augusta to launch it? Down to what, the, what would the dream be? How, how fast? Uh, look, yeah. if we could get, I could guess, get someone to 10, 10, 12 knots out of yeah. it, we'd be, we'd be fairly honking along. Yeah, you know, like, it's just a bit of fun, you know, it's, it's, it's... Christmas party. Yeah, Christmas party. It's our, it's our, it's actually, today's December the 24th, so it's Christmas Eve and this is our EV power Christmas party. This is what we do for our kicks. <laughs> so.